It's good to visualize your project as a whole, from concept to completion, because your desired end product will affect all your decisions. Technical decisions such as what format to shoot on and what programs to edit with, as well as creative decisions such as concept, storyline, types of shots, and music. If you know that your end product will be a small video format such as a podcast, you might want a simple setup such as this. This is a digital video camera that's connected via firewire to my computer. So no matter what format you're shooting on, it's always best to shoot in the best lighting conditions possible with the highest quality and really good sound recording. There are many types of software out there for editing. But if you're planning to do something such as a podcast, it's easiest if you use something with the export to iPod function. That's the 320 by 240 function. QuickTime 7.03 or higher has this function, and it comes in around $30, so um, it also allows you to do simple edits. In terms of editing techniques, you should choose shots that will stand out on a handheld device. Text should be large and easy to read, and you'll want to keep transitions simple to reduce any unwanted effects from compression. Some of the most interesting videos are intimate stories or witty snippets of life. Podcasts are a few minutes long max, so you'll want to keep your story punchy within that time, to also to keep files small. The most common format for video iPods is the .m4b format. So once you've edited your piece and set your in and out points, you'll want to export to a format that your handheld device can read. For video iPods, the most common format is a .m4v format, which is easily created using the export to iPod function on QuickTime 7.03 or higher. Also, Final Cut Pro and iTunes newer versions that have this QuickTime installed, you can also use that function. You can also use this function on newer versions of Final Cut Pro and iTunes that have QuickTime installed. The small video media is the fastest growing format for video art. With new products such as cell phones and iPods, creating content has never been easier to create and produce.